Somebody look at your neighbor and say, she finna bring it tonight. I say, somebody look at your neighbor and say, she finna bring it tonight. And if you ain't got a neighbor, look at yourself and say, she finna bring it to fuck a night. Oh, we gonna jump right into it, because that's how we do it over here. I ain't gonna tarry too long tonight, y'all. But folks been asking me. He said, so, so, madam, what's going on with that situation with True Goy? What ancestors done showed you on that right there? Now, before we talk about that situation, I want to first give y'all some background information on who he was. Is that all right? True Goy was born on September the 21st in 1968. And he was born in Brooklyn, New York. He grew up in the Long Island hamlet of East Massapequa. In his teenage years, he attended Amityville Memorial High School, where he later graduated. While True Goy was in Amityville High School, he met and became friends with Vincent Mason, Calvin Mercer, and they later formed a group called De La Soul. When the group De La Soul joined together with the producer Prince Paul, the record Three Feet High and Rising was created. When that debut album was released in 1989, the group De La Soul started blowing up, going to the next level. And at that time, they really made a name for themselves inside of the music industry. We fast forward to today. And not too long ago, the news report said that True Goy passed away. The news reports that I read, it didn't speak on exactly why he passed. They just told us that he passed away slash transition. But folks ask me, and they say, so, so, madam, what ancestors done showed you on this right here? Huh. An ancestor said, bull to the shit. -taker. That's what they say. You know, I got to say allegedly, but this was a plan. Sacrifice, my people. A sacrifice had to be made in order for De La Soul to receive something. I'm going somewhere with this tonight. Some folks, y'all probably forget. But not too long ago, TMZ News, they reported. They reported something not too long ago. And they said that the group De La Soul was battling with their ex-record label, their past record label, for many years to have their music on streaming services. That's what TMZ told us back in some time ago. At that time, TMZ News said, now finally that war is over because in March, 2023, this year, they gonna be able to share their music with the fans, old and new fans, and everybody all over the world. That's what TMZ News told us. Let's put it together. Ancestor said, in order for them to, to get their music on streaming services, there had to be a sacrificial lamb for the group De La Soul. And the sacrificial lamb that was chosen for the group De La Soul was True Goy. When you look up their past interviews, True Goy, he was more vocal. And he was kind of always speaking out against things going on in the industry. Look it up. And that's one of the main reasons that he was sacrificed. And there's some other reasons as well on why he was what? Thun down the rabbit hole to be the sacrificial lamb. That rabbit hole go deeper right there, y'all. 
Do y'all think it's just a, a coincidence that next month in March, after years of them waiting, De La So finally get this, this deal to have their music stream to the whole wide world. And then all of a sudden, a month before the music streaming deal start, one of the group members end up dead. Come on, y'all. One of the group members end up dead, stinking in a grave. It ain't no coincidence. And sister said, the rest of the group members left in De La So know what's up. That producer, Prince Paul, he know what's up. And there's some other folks in the background that know what's up. On why he had to go. Why True Goy had to be the sacrificial lamb. Put the pieces of the puzzle together, my people. I know you see it. You know how we do it over here. Murder by them fuckers' numbers. True Goy passed away. Transition on February 12th, 2023. Let's add that up and see what we get. Two plus one plus two plus two plus two plus three equal what? Twelve. One plus two equal what? Three. Diggo out three right there. Huh? He passed away at age 54. Five plus four equal what? Nine. What you do with that nine? You turn it around like they do. Then you get the number what? Six. Put it together and you get what? The three six murder by numbers. Y'all know I gotta say, allegedly. But this was another what? Another sacrifice, y'all. Another sacrifice. And don't be surprised if we start seeing the, the, the rest of the group members a day lasso. And then the, the producer, Prince Paul. Don't, don't be surprised if we, we start seeing them in, in little movie clips or commercials and things of that nature on TV and shit to because we know how they do it. See, they got to put it out to us like that. Just to see if we're going to be able to do what? Put it together. I got some more shorts coming today. Y'all pay attention to them shorts. And I got more videos coming this week. Y'all be good. All right?